Hey there, anonymous bystander. Uh, my name's Spiff. Well, it's not really my name, but, you know, for all intents and purposes. Uh, and we're going to be playing Passerby by Ape, Apish Box Games. An odd name. I literally can't remember anything about this game. How's it go? And you know what? I edited that one video of Raven's Watch where um, Hale does the intro. And he, like, pre pretends to do the intro that I do. And it it's made me very self-conscious about my intros. All I'm saying. Thanks for that, Hale. Uh, my name is Nathan. I am a loner wandering through a desolate and shattered world. For me, it was always a dark, unforgiving wasteland. Difference is that now it is overrun by infected monsters. Nobody knows exactly what happened. After the fallout, people started forming factions, different groups to survive. I always felt like an outsider, and now I became a passerby. I know that my fate hangs in the balance, and that it could be severed at any moment by the horrors that lurk in the darkness. Okay. I fuck with that premise, actually. You know what? We don't see many, like, uh, Shifter Sprint. We don't see many, like, post-apocalyptic horror games these days. I did not see what he just said. Find shelter. Okay. Like the, I mean, obviously that that graphics is not best, but this is like, I this is a cute little environment. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. I feel like a grocery store is a pretty good shelter, right? Right. That it's already been looted though. Except the vending machines look perfectly intact. Is does this not count as shelter? Is this, I feel like this is a good enough shelter for me, but I guess not. So we keep looking. Police station, perhaps? Knock, knock. Hello, it's me, the police. Is that me in? No? All right. Understandable. What, a, what an interesting environment. I don't know. I fuck with it. All right, this looks like shelter. Ooh, what's this? He's in the shelf, open the locked door of the building by the road. Stay inside, wait for the night to pass, and then do whatever you want. Not go outside at night. If you're reading this, that means I'm already gone. You'll still have a chance to survive. Good luck to all. Okay, so we have a key now. It said it unlocks the door... Sorry, where? Locked door of the building by the road. Brother, all of these buildings are by the road. What do you... What does that... What? It's a city. All of the buildings are by the road. Is it this one? I'm going to assume no. That one's already unlocked. Uh... That one doesn't look like it has doors anymore. Yo, what the hell is going on up there? Yeah, I don't... Is it this building? This is, oh, this is not a building. This is some kind of flammable something something going on there. Okay. Is it, is it supposed to be one of these like high rises that it's talking about? Building by the road. Brother, I legit... Oh wait, there was another... There's another uh, poster there. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I've missed important lore. The air is filled with the stench of decay. People are more aggressive than the infected creatures. There is nothing left of this town besides crumbling buildings and trash. I try to care about the situation, but why bother? Every day I get closer and closer to ending it all. Maybe one day I can find the courage to do so. God damn fucking most relatable note I've ever read in a video game. Am I right, fellas? Don't answer that question. Uh, I'm gonna check this building, maybe. This building is... It, maybe it was this? I, I would love to be able to close the door. Is this gonna be literally a zombie survival game, like where I gotta whip out a gun and like... Is this gonna be a COD zombie situation? This is feeling mildly like a COD zombie situation. Okay, can't interact with any of this. Uh, let's go upstairs, I guess. Oh, yeah, this is the shelter. Okay, because here it's telling me to put my bag down. 
Looks cozy. I should look for supplies. Usually I find stuff in the trash. Okay, search trash bins. Uh, like outside? Who broke all of these perfectly good machines? Oh, ooh, another note. Amidst all the struggles, I refuse to give up on my dream. One day I will stop hiding, scavenging for scraps, rationing the supplies, and I'll move away from this cursed town. Open up a restaurant at the end of the world, where people rejoice, have fun, and remember that not everything is lost. One day. Honestly, I've, that's a noble dream. Yeah, I don't think that's trash. I think I'm gonna have to go down into the street and search trash bins. So, by the way, this is the fucking thickest radiator I've ever seen in my life. So that's all I wanted to comment on. Is this trash? It specifically says trash bins. I'm assuming just the like regular trash that's lying around. Ain't it, chief? Are there trash bins back here? Mayhaps. Are these bins? I mean, they are literally trash bins, but I don't think it's the trash bins that the game wants me to look through. You know what, this area here is reminding me of Slender the Eight Pages. God. I went to a sleepover once with some of my friends when we were like, I don't know, 15 or something. And uh, one of them had a copy of Slender the Eight Pages and we, we took turns playing the game and like, scaring the shit out of ourselves. Man, we were such wusses back then. Well, I mean, it's a scary game, but like... Yeah, come on, it's not its not that scary. I feel like here would be a good place to search for things, but again, I, I apparently uh, disagree. Boo, it's me, the Slenderman. It's the Slenderman! Ah! Okay, does this count as trash bins? Oh no, is it this? Is this what it's telling me? I'm assuming that's how much I've searched. Okay, there we go. Wood scraps. I guess the sound was empty before the fallout. I was very confused by that bar. I, I, you know, dude, I should place the end of the eight pages again one one of these days. I don't even know if it like still runs because wasn't it made for like Windows XP all the fuck way back in the days? Torn clothing scraps and dented cooking pots and be used, I guess. All right. Okay, where are some more trash bins? I am a little raccoon and I desire the bins. Give them to me. That place looks mildly important. Like we're gonna have to go there again later. Is there a trash bin I missed? I think that's one right there. I think that's the only one I missed. Maybe. I've searched that. Those two over there. I think this is the one I missed. All right. Dude, my hands would be so fucking cut up if I'm just like searching through a bunch of random shit. Found rubber tubing, empty food containers, and nothing else useful. Like, how many drugs would I have just injected into myself? I'm getting tired, it's getting dark, I should go back to the shelter and sleep in bed. The bed didn't even have a mattress though, it was just a... a okay, sure. At least let me I close this door. Thank you. There we go. Found out that the decal tool exists in the nicest way possible, yeah? Alright, rest in shelter. Wait, is that a mattress? Does not look like a mattress to me. Is this- I'm using that as my pillow? Okay. I mean, that makes sense. We would have thought at this point I might have found a blanket or something. Someone is at the door. Who could it be at this time? I should be careful. I would just tell them to fuck off. Wow, a flashlight that actually works? This cannot be. 
And this person actually got to make a game while still not understanding how to make a triangle in Blender. Ooh, we got the spooky music chant. Check the door. My, please tell me I'm not going to actually open it. Why would I open the door? If someone is hurt, I should be careful following this blood trail. Oh, hey, there's a zombie right there. I should not follow this blood trail, brother. I should go back inside. Am I stupid? Why would I follow the blood trail? Like, I want to die. Oh. You are massive. Dude, you are immensely large. What the hell? Please help. I was at the group and got lost. I have a walkie-talkie with me and I dropped it near the police station. Please find it. You, you don't want me to, like, patch you up, brother? Or, like, bandage or anything? You don't want me to, like, drag you inside where it's safe? You... Really? Alright. Alright, dude. Sure. I'll, um, I'll go find that, that walkie-talkie for you. Don't you worry. Please tell me I can get out this way. Oh, I think I can. Okay, so there's like a few zombie lads. Yeah, I see them. Kind of, can I cr like crouch or anything? No. Can I turn my flashlight off? No. Okay. Yeah, that dude never skips leg day. In fact, that's the only day. Okay, so we have to f somehow get around all of these guys. Which I think is going to be a massive pain in my asshole. Okay, not that way. Good to know. I wonder if I can just run faster than them. Because it genuinely looks like there is not, like, a gap to walk through. Unless their detection radius is very small. Maybe the detection radius is ass and I can just, like... See one on the right there. There's one on the left. Just, like, go in here and then out the back, maybe? Hit them with golf balls. Very good. Use my nine iron. But I use my nine iron. Nine iron. Oh God, words are hard. Whatever. Fuck you. Use it up your assholes. That was what I was going to say. I like just sneak past here, maybe. I'm going to turn one of these corners and there's going to be one of these fuckos like right there. Oh, yeah. There's one right there. Why is he at the back there? What is his plan? Where is the walkie-talkie, though? Think it's gonna be in the police station? No. Nine inch dick? Sure. Hey, that guy's walking towards me. I feel like at this point, like, I would have maybe found some kind of weapon or something to use against these guys. They don't seem very, like, like they're slow. Why would I not just beat the shit out of them? You know what I'm saying? Just whip out a fucking weapon and just start beating the shit out of him. Yeah, I'm gonna try and go around this way because this guy is now walking away. There it is. I got it. I got it. Pogs, pogs, poggers, pogs. All right. Now it doesn't act. It doesn't say I need to go back to him, but I'm assuming that that's what I have to do. Maybe I only ever did leg day two. Very possible. Oh shit, this guy's here now. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta wait for a second to the slow ass motherfucker to walk all the way this way. We can walk past him. Okay, no, he's turned away now. Maybe we should be fine. Do a little, do a little, you know, walk past. Yeah, we Gucci gang. There we go. No worries. See? No worries. Except I'm mildly worried now that one of them's going to see me. No. Okay, we're good. Go back to this idiot. Oh, he's going to be a zombie by the time I get here, isn't he? I can feel it in my bones. Or just dead. No, he's still alive. Okay. Apparently I patched him up. Thanks for helping me, dragging me out here. It's very cozy and safe. 
Yeah, no problem. Uh, I hope you did not get infected. Looks like you lost a lot of blood. No, no, this is not mine. I actually met somebody on the way here and they were pretty aggressive. You know, we have to survive no matter what. Got into a fight, they lost. Meanwhile, it got dark. Like I said, I'm with a group of people and we share a certain ideology around here. Wait, wait. Why were they aggressive and, and what happened to them? We had a disagreement about my offer. I did rush some things because it was getting dark and I proposed to them to join my group and they refused, saying that I was insane or some shit. Maybe they did not want to be part of the group and they were a passerby, like me, but... What exactly did you tell them? People around here do not get aggressive for no solid reason. I personally find it hilarious, but my group likes to hunt. We gather the supplies and mostly survive on meat. Meat? Where do you get the meat at this time? We all know that the infected are spreading more and more. There's polluted and there's no way... Wait. Do you hunt infected monsters and eat them? No way. You think we're savages? Not at all. We hunt for fresh meat every single day. I thought you'd be smarter than this. Come on. We're cannibals. Listen, relax, okay? We already got our share for today, and I guess you're the lucky one. Get the fuck out of here. I have a gun in my bag, and I swear I will shoot you. Whoa, 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 relax. I'm not gonna hurt you. If you want, you can join my group. If not, I can leave. I will not join your mind-fucked group. Get the hell out, asshole. I am warning you. All right, all right, I'm going. Sorry for making things uncomfortable, right? I just stand up and leave. But I have to say that my group is already here. I wish we had more time to discuss this. Okay. <laughs> um, okay. Moral of the story, never trust anyone ever. And also, like, just shoot people, I guess, or something. I don't know. That was a game. <laughs>